this is day five of 100 days of coding challenge. And this uh, day five, we are going to solve a problem on code signal website. The question is a, a given a string, uh, your task is to replace each of its characters by the next one in the English alphabet. For instance, replace A with B, replace B with C. This is called alphabetic shift. So we shift the alphabetic, uh, uh, the letter in the alphabet uh, by one digit. So uh, for example, Z uh, would be replaced by A. It shifts to the left because Z is the end of the alphabet. And the start of the alphabet is A. So this uh, problem is similar to the plain cipher in networking. So how can you do this? For input string crazy, the output should be uh, DSBS. Okay, let's try to see the solutions. How can you, we solve this problem? Uh, first, let's talk about the two important functions we are going to use in this, uh, to solve this problem. One is already, already is a Python built-in function that returns the, uh, number representing the specified uh, character in the alphabet. Alphabet. And the other most important is CHR function, which returns, returns the string representing a specified specified unicode of number. And uh, let's look at our solution. That is, let's define a, an MBT uh, variable, which contains a string. And let's iterate over the input string and uh, for i in a list of input string, we convert the input string into list to easily iterate each character in the input string. Then we shift. Uh, in this case, we are going to use rd and i. So this rd convert the character into uh, number which representing uh, the specified character and we subtract the ORD of A that is 97 actually A representing a number is 97 and then finally we add one because that uh, character should be shift by one digit so the shifting is already we know that is one and we modulus the result of the shift by uh, 26. 26, uh, because we have 26 number of letters in the English alphabet. And finally, we add 97, because that is A, representing A in the alphabet. Now we just append to the string that is CHR. SH because the result of uh, this could be number. So what is the uh, a string representing of a specified unicode of the number? So it converts to a specified character from that number. And finally, we, we return our results to see this solution is best fit or not. Okay. Let's test our code. Uh, click on run tests button on bottom of this uh, page. Click run and let's see. Yeah, it passes five out of five uh, testing stages. And there are also hidden tests. So we should click on submit to uh, confirm our solution is passed or uh, 
testing stages. Let's click on submit. Yeah, it is correct. So our solution is best for uh, this problem. So it could uh, automatically solve this problem. And uh, uh, so you can try uh, your own solution also. So thanks for watching for now.